so good. What's going on guys, it's Matt here, and in this video, we're going to be doing the shoes today. Now, what I did was, I went to Walmart and I got some black water shoes. Now, I know they're not 100% movie accurate, obviously, but I just thought it'd be a little, just a little easy, just to apply this to the suit. Now I originally wanted to maybe get some boots or some boxing shoes or something just to put it in the shoe, in the suit that way it gives it the nice boot shape that it needs but unfortunately I wasn't able to do that because <clears throat> I just didn't really want to have to go through the hassle of ordering some shoes online and waiting for them so I just went to Walmart couldn't find any boots there either, but I did find water shoes, and I found these black water, water shoes, so. What I'm going to be doing is just cutting uh, the shoe with some scissors, just cut around the rubber, since this is pretty thin, like, material, I mean, it's, it shouldn't be that difficult to cut, especially with just some scissors. But, yep, that should be the start of the shoes. And what I'm going to do to glue the shoes onto the suit is use E6000. Um, this stuff works really great with like fabric and all that. And it's a permanent bond. It's washer and dryer safe photo safe and flexible I got the black the black version because well since it's on a black sole I figured why not you know it'll blend in if it leaks out or something like that so yeah so yeah I'm just gonna use e6000 and apply it onto the suit but right now I'm just gonna cut it up so I just have the sole and that should be it all right and um, I'm just gonna be cutting it up with some scissors now and yeah let's hopefully it goes well all right and it's voiceover time and right now I'm just taking out the insoles that came with the water shoes and that actually came in pretty handy because that'll add extra comfort once the shoes are on and yeah, that, 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 that was very nice to have, but I'm just cutting along the rubber soles and doing that for both shoes, and that's pretty much it. Alright, and here are the soles. Completely torn up from that mesh stuff that you've covered in, but yep, here they are. Here's the little padding that came inside the shoe and still fit, of course. But what I'm going to do is take these, these paddings and I'm going to put it inside the suit when I'm wearing, uh, when I'm putting on the soles and it'll always just be comfortable for me to wear whenever I do wear it so yeah pretty nice pretty nice pretty easy cut nothing too difficult just using scissors cutting around the rubber and that's about it so I have the shoes here laid out on the floor and I also have the suit on fully so I can just step right in um, I also have the padded soles on the inside of the suit, and yeah, I'm about to apply this E6000 onto the soles there, and I'm just going to use this broken pencil just to spread the glue a little bit e easier. Alright, and I have the glue down in the shoe, 
And now all I gotta do is step right in. Make sure that the soles on the inside are placed properly. Okay. Okay. Be good. All right, here we go. Move the left leg. And it's down. Just putting some pressure on the side. Here we go. All right, now it's down as well. Both are down. Put some pressure on the sides. Now, after, after I've been in the suit for a while, I'm gonna also just put some extra glue right here and then kind of just force the fabric onto the, onto the, the rubber soles. And the shoes are pretty much stuck on there. Now I'm gonna just let it sit overnight and I just put my amp on top of the shoes just to add a little more pressure onto the shoes while they sit overnight um yep that should that should definitely keep the soles from falling off after this is done drying the next day and i now have soles on my spidey suit definitely attached and yeah that's basically the video so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and until next time guys i'll see you on the flip flop later